Hello again, everybody, and welcome back to yet another episode of Final Fantasy VI. This is Skywalker, and that's Edgar, and that's the shopkeeper across the counter. And we also have Locke and Terra with us. We're all geared up and ready to continue our search for the Returner's hideout. Um, Edgar's leading the way. Um, I was going to show you the end this episode. Last episode, we checked out the relics really quickly. Um, let's go to the innkeeper. 80 GP per night. Why not? I know Terra's down on her magic points. So that's this is the uh, the end sequence. Very simple, self-explanatory. You pay up front. You get the room, and uh, everything is healed up, as you can see from the status menu. Terra's now at 61 MP over there on the side. So, that's good. Um, we've been hearing a lot about Mount Cults, and I'm assuming that's exactly where we're going to go. We've also been hearing about some kind of uh, martial artists in the area. We saw, uh, what's his name? Shadow, one of the main characters last episode, always be sure to come to, when you come to South Figaro in this inn, you be, make sure you go talk to him and name him whatever you want, and he'll be end, end up showing up for you later on, most likely. So let's skedaddle out of town. There's a Chocobo uh, farm, just in case you were wondering. Let's see if there's anything in this barrel. Come on, you can't do it? Crappy version, can't get it right. Let's see what he says. Check up a ride. I'm gonna put no, because I don't mind uh, getting the XP on the walk. It's something we can use. Let's head north. To the little cottage up here. See some. Hmm, what's that smell? Flowers, his favorite flowers. And this is favorite tea. I think you recognize some. Oh, we got Tonic out of that barrel. These dishes, they were his favorite. You know what? I think we could have came here. If you got into this bed on the left, that might Oh shoot. See, that's a free a free night's sleep, so you don't have to pay the 80 GP if you don't want. This is, uh, like, a little bit, okay, directly north, a little bit east of South Figaro. Sabin, he was here, okay. So his brother used, was in that cottage. Who's this guy? You know this guy? Of course, he left a couple of days ago after he heard Master Duncan was slain, he headed into the mountains. I heard Duncan's son Vargas is missing as well. I have a bad feeling about this. Alright, we heard about those characters before. Sabin is Edgar's brother, twin brother. And Duncan we heard about in South Figaro. He's been training with Vargas, I think. Or Vargas was training with Duncan, I forgot who. Mount Colts, here we go. I used to have a problem with this part, usually around the end, but I don't think we'll have any problems today. It's, I've been playing this game for years. We have a Tusker. Let's go ahead and do Noise Blaster on these guys, just for the hell of it. Oh, I 
scored himself a 78. Do auto crossbow. After a fire. Oh, I can steal attack him. Oh. There we go. 108 XP, 204 GP. Looks good. If you notice, there was a mysterious character up in the top right hand corner that was like all black, like a shadow. I barely caught it myself. Why not fire these guys to death if that don't work? It does work. Did it work? It didn't work? This is gonna hurt. Ooh! 140. That's what you get for sticking around. There he is, he disappeared though. Alright, how do we get over here? Let's see. There's a secret in here somewhere. Alright, we got a pincer attack. Let's steal from the guy who's not looking at me. And I want to see a bio blaster on these guys. Did I steal anything? I didn't even notice. Oh, that heals him? Oh, wow. Alright, so... Word to the wise, don't use any kind of poison attacks on these brawlers, because they will get healed. If you see those green numbers pop up, you're healing people, so... There we go. Now, did we end up stealing something? I think you could steal some from these brawlers that's useful. If it's not, you could sell it. For a little bit of coin. I'm gonna check the inventory really quickly. I think it's a defensive item. Um, leather armor? Did I steal leather armors? I might have. Let's go ahead and arrange everything. Oh, uh, he's already got leather armor. Alright. Nothing new. Mithril knife here, put that mithril knife on. Yeah, alright. Oh well, I should have been paying closer attention. Guardian, alright, let's check out this guardian. I think it's a weapon. I'll put it on lock. The Guardian's gonna raise your speed, the battle power, and the evade. Nice. So we'll put that on him. I, lo I want him to go faster because I want to be able to steal in any case. That's before we end up slaughtering everything. Oh, oh man, I might have a fight. I don't know, retard. Wow. Below the 100 mark, I have to do the heal thing next time. Blah. Woohoo! Terra gained a level. Alright, Terra will be healing next battle. Let's go up this way. There he goes again. Trillium, Tusker, and a Sue, Serpius or something. Let us do a noise blast real quick. Oh, I forgot to heal. I'll be healing in a second. I'm gonna confuse them first off. There you go. 
Oh wow. Couldn't steal. Why not? Do fall. Wow, is that an automatic KO? I don't, I don't remember that being an automatic KO. I didn't see any numbers. It was just like a one-hit kill. Interesting. I'm going to keep confusing them if they keep doing that. Lock has gained a level. Huh, we got two different caves. Oh, we oh, ran into a random encounter. Serpius. Get noise blaster. Did I do it right? Oh, I missed it. Alright, that's a one hit kill in any case. 82 XP, 306 GP. A tent. Awesome. And they are not skimping on these these battles. Alright, let's steal from you. Um, uh, I'm just gonna fight the guys not facing me. We'll do auto crossbow. Let's steal. not getting that chance. The reason I didn't heal is because I can't heal everybody in my party with Terra because locks on one side. That's something you gotta pay attention to. Uh, I'd only be able to heal Terra and Edgar because they were on one side of the battlefield. That's the all will only work on one side of the battlefield I th usually. Unless you have something that hits every enemy and every ally, which the, I think there are a few out there. But we're not gonna get those for a long time. Here we go. Now's a chance. Couldn't steal. Man, you're the worst steal right now. I don't know what your deal is. Alright. Back over the 100 mark. Couldn't steal again? Alright, we blocked it! Edgar's HP is pretty high. He's going to be a heavy hitter later on, I think. He's one of my favorites with his uh, different machines. Oh my goodness! Game, what is going on? Uh, auto crossbow. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and fire these guys up. Maybe he'll break 200 X, uh, HP. Wait and see. Is that mysterious character jumping around again? Serpius. One hit kill. Let's cross this bridge. Oh, we had a chance to rest up right here. I 
think what I'll do is go ahead and use a back or was it? We're gonna use one sleeping bag as you see it recovers HP and MP to 100%. We're gonna use a sleeping bag on Terra. Um, and then Terra is oh we're gonna use these what are these tonics we can get? Let's use some tonics. Bam, bam. That should do it. And I'm also going to take this time to save, so please bear with me for just a short second here. I'll be as quick as possible. Save over our last one. Alright. Good, good, good. So we won't have to go back through all that if we end up dying. Which is always a good thing. Let's continue. like you don't like fire, so I'm gonna go for that. And I'm also gonna auto crossbow you. Nice block. I like that. Uh-oh. Oh, she's been poisoned. No, not good. I think she's got the antidote spell. We'll have to use it in a second. Now, this is something I wasn't too good with when I was, you know, a young player, but I think poison lasts. So I'll show you for a second. A split second because I don't want to hurt her too bad poison lasts even after you get out of battle so watch this see how the screen blurs like that when I move that means she's gonna be taking damage over time so you're gonna need to take care of that she's already at 145 um you can use antidotes which we have four of I actually might end up using that um, you can also use if Terra has it she has antidote that's costing 3 MP I'm gonna save that MP just in case we're gonna go ahead and use an antidote. They're not too too expensive, I don't believe. It cures poison status. Uh, as you can see, there's an icon on Terra. Before I do this, uh, that's the spot right next to the names. Usually, it's the spot where you'll see status effects that have lasted after battle. That's either positive or negative. So, if you think something's up and you're not sure why, go ahead and check that status screen just to see if there's any icons there. There we go. Got rid of that poison. And let's move on. Oh man, I went backtrack. Darn it! I always have that problem in this area. I want to confuse you. Confuse her. Stoltz on it. There we go. Peek somebody to death. One hit kill. Wow. That should clean him up right there. Like that. Auto crossbow. 141 XP, Terra gained a level, found 440 GP. Okay, let's continue through Mount Colts. We have ourselves another battle. I am around the 20 minute mark. We're gonna have to end this sooner or later. Got ourselves another trio of monsters. I got all their attacks off before I got to do the noise blaster, so I don't know if this is worthwhile or not. Another tonic. There's another technique I haven't seen in the... Wow. Interesting. D 
death. Death. 141 XP. Lock has gained a level. Found 440 GP. Alright guys, I think that's going to wrap it up for this episode's trek through Mount Cults. We'll pick right back up where it left off uh, next episode. So uh, this has been the Skywalker, and I'll see you guys next episode.